Welcome back to Choice Cuts, episode 33. I am joined by Bria Grant. How are you doing? I'm good. We have interviewed you before on uh, Shock Till You Drop. Yes. Um, not, we, not on camera. Not on camera. No, no, no. no. We, we were sat down for us to talk about your comic book series. That's true. Yeah, yeah. But this is, I wanted to get you in the chair to kind of talk about all sorts of stuff. Oh. Um, I'm slowly catching up to Heroes, so I finally got up to your episodes. <laughs> So tell us a little bit about yourself. I'm curious, when, what was your first exposure to horror? Because, I mean, you look at your resume, and if you look at the IMDb, you see you've done a lot of stuff. At the IMDb. It's at like the, at the, the internet. I, <laughs> the internet. <laughs> the internet. Um, you know, I mean, I'm curious. What, what was that kind of spark for you? Um, you mean as a child and, or as an actress? Actress. Hmm, the way I said I'm, that I'm, was like an actress. <laughs> the actress. Uh, <laughs> let's go back. I mean, as a, as a child. I, I, I liked it as a child. I have... Um, you know, I I grew up a girl. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and yeah, that's Thank you. difficult to understand. <laughs> yeah. um, so I, I was exposed to it a little bit less than I think um, some people were growing up. But I did yeah. love it as a child, and I have an older brother, which is very helpful mm -hmm. in, in um, knowing about horror. But I was actually just talking about this, about how the movie that scared me the most as a kid was Tremors. Oh, yeah. That movie scared me so much. And we would play Tremors. Like we instead, It was like it's similar to the game of Lava. Okay. Which is where you put, you know, pillows on the ground and you jump from pillow to pillow. Yeah. Tremors, it's you jump from pillow to pillow, That's but cool. instead you get eaten by a, wow. a sand. Wow. You raise, raise your kids with that kind of game. That's you great. really, yeah, you really cut. Just change it from lava to tremors, obviously. Yeah, tr yeah. Nice. Yeah. So I, I mean, I watched horror movies as a kid, and um, and I and I've always liked them a lot. I definitely got into them more when I became an actress and I felt like I was sort of seeking out places where there are a lot of female leads and mm -hmm. I mean that's a place where you find a lot of, of women yeah. actually. Yeah. Well you did um, a film called Midnight Movie. I did. Yeah, which they keep they, they keep they keep seeming to bring well. I mean the producers are very persistent. They they are. <laughs> they keep bringing you know it what? out. Which I'm going to give that. That's good. No, it is. I mean yeah. and I'm glad that he was the director was able to get his own director's cut back out there yeah, I mean, Jack, and yeah. kind of inject it back into the, you know, into the audience. I mean they had a premiere down in Westwood, right? Yeah, we, yeah. I was there. Yeah. Um yeah, I mean that was um I that was I I think probably if not my first movie, it was like my first like one like I wasn't like a union actress like I was mm. like very new here, very green, and I went in and shot that for like a week or something, and it was terribly exciting. We shot in some old movie theater, yeah. um, and I was the very sassy, bitchy um, girl worked at the counter, which I'm great at. <laughs> great at being sassy. Now I'm curious. There's one uh, film that I remember reporting on a while back uh, called Trance. That's true. Trance. Yeah, and unreleased. Still kind of floating in the ether somewhere. The and yeah, I mean, I guess that's your job. Yeah, your job is, is to yeah, know this yeah. stuff. But, um, I mean, uh, but I mean, tell us about the movie because I know a lot of people are watching this are going, what's Trance? You know? Right. Trance um, is a movie about, um, no, you have to forgive me because this has been four years. A while ago, yeah. Four years. Um, so Trance is a movie about a bunch of kids who go to a rave on Halloween and there's a drug that they take and it makes the girls kill the boys. Okay. I liked that. Yeah. That was cool. Um, and I was the first girl to take the drug, and I um, ran around on rollerblades the whole night. It was like crazy Intentionally white Intentionally on rollerblades? You were well, I was like a Catholic school girl outfit, in, but I was wearing rollerblades. But I was literally on some rollerblades the whole movie, which was kind of crazy. Yeah. I'm, oh, I'm, a, I'm good at skating, yeah. but that is kind of a, a lot of... And it was funny because I didn't know that, and I got there, and the director was like, do you skate? <laughs> and I was like, thank God I do. Um, but yeah, it was. I mean, it was a really cool movie. It was a lot of local um, Louisiana actors because mm -hmm. we shot it in Baton Rouge, where um, there's a lot of horror movies being shot there yeah. in the past few years, and um, and it was super fun. It never came out. I've actually seen it. I've seen bits and pieces of it, and it's really super fun. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Madeline Zena's in it. She's great. Yeah, she was um, in um, California. She was in California. Yep. She was. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's really, it's really fun. Who is the director on that? Hans. Yeah, his Hans. Yeah. Hans but he's going under a different name for that one, I think. He is. Yeah. I don't know what I'm supposed to say <laughs> about that. I don't, well, no, like, he, I'm going to turn around because I don't know what I'm supposed to say. Yeah, no, I mean, like, I remember there was a, uh, uh, I remember he had emailed me about it, and he was like, I don't know if this thing's ever going to see the light of day, but if you don't be surprised if it goes out under someone else's name. And I yeah. was like, dude, it's okay. You can. Yeah, it happens. It yeah. happens. Um, but, I mean, you know, I, yeah, I don't think it'll ever. Yeah. It'll ever happen. But um, it was really fun, and I got to beat a guy's head in with a beer bottle. Nice. And that was the first time I had ever done that. And it was like fake, like the first time I had dealt with like, they had like a fake dummy head and I got to beat it and 
they like literally someone sat underneath like flicked blood at me you know so it looked like I was like getting yeah that's cool that's what uh let's talk about Dexter okay uh, I saw that you had posted on your website blog, you know, the trailer for Dexter, I did. the next yeah. season, and that you come in and it's about the minute mark. I do. Really quick. Like I like him leaning over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, talk about. I mean, uh, one, uh, how cool is it to get on the show? And two, who do you play? Um, it's awesome. Yeah. I um. Well, I mean, I I mean, it's awesome. It's another one of those things where I feel like I'm joining this family that's yeah. been around for five years before me, but they're they've been really really nice, and um. It, I'm playing a, a lab intern in Masuka's lab. Oh, nice. And I'm sort of hiring on, he hires on a new intern, and I sort of go in and cause some problems, and, you know, as, as my characters like to do. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the most things I cause problems. So, on. yeah, I mean, you were, I mean, working in Masuka's lab, you were integral to that whole thing. That's awesome. It's true. That's it's true. really cool. It's nice. It's fun, too. I mean, it's fun because, um, I, because I'm smart, yeah. and I get to play smart characters, but I also get to play really fun, sort of deviant characters in a lot of times. And it's nice to hear that they're actually finding, they're injecting somebody that he can bounce off of. That act, you know. Yeah, I mean, I think that's the, the, I mean, you know, the the nice thing about it is that you have these awesome characters on these shows that have, like, their, like, their stick and their thing they do, but it's nice to see them get a little storyline and have, like, more to do in the world. Are you still shooting? I, I am done. I'm You're finished, done? Yes. Okay. Are you coming back? We'll see. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's the, the go-to answer. To do. The one thing Maybe. I would do is like not tell too much about it. Of course, it. <laughs> of course. No, no, no. I mean, it I've looks been really exciting. Well. <laughs>